Good afternoon and happy Friday, Lindsay. Nico with Cliff Jones RV here in Sealy. So Brandy told me that you had some interest in this Wolfpack 27 Pack 10. Wanted to go ahead and make you a video so you can see all about it. This is a 2023 model. It's got some new and exciting features. So up front here, we have a power tongue jack. You're not gonna have to hand crank as you hook and unhook, just press it and it'll go up and down. We also have a built-in light as well so you can see early in the morning and late at night when you're hooking up. It's got two propane tanks. Unlike our competitors, we do not have any hidden freight or make ready charges. So whatever price we come up with includes the freight to get it down here from the factory and also getting it ready for you. So this is gonna be the main storage on the outside. It is a pass-through, so you have plenty of room there. It's also got tie-downs as well, so you can keep your belongings secure. It does have a freestanding table that's included. This is how they send it in from the factory, and also the 50 amp power cord. It does also have prep for cameras all the way around the unit, so on the running light here, you can see it's got that prep for the Furion camera, and there's also one in the back as well. Another great thing about this RV is that it is fiberglass. So not only does it look great, it's gonna hold up much better with heavy rain and hail, and it also has better insulation too. This does have a fully heated and enclosed underbelly, so wherever you and your family decide to go camping, you can rest assured that when you have your furnace on, it'll keep your plumbing from freezing. We also have solar tint here. As you can see, it's got that mirrored finish, so that gives you more privacy and more energy efficiency as well. Here we have the outdoor kitchen. It's got everything you need and more. Compact fridge for easy access to food and drinks. We also have an ice maker here as well. And it does have a spray port. This is an outside shower. So what you can do is just attach the hose, pour some water in there, and it'll start batching ice in about 15 minutes. We have a two burner propane cooktop here as well if you wanna cook outside in a non plumb sink. And then whenever you're done with it, just remove the flash like that, it slides right in, and this door just closes like that. Super duper easy. We also have marine grade speakers outside. You can play music just inside, just outside, or both. And it also has mount for a TV here as well that just slides right on. And then you have coaxial and power here too. Another great thing is that your furnace is right here. So as we're in the colder season right now, when this is on, you can stand around here and gather some warmth. And it has a leash latch as well if you wanna bring Cairo along. And another great thing is that we do have a tankless water heater as well. That's a new feature for this year. And that's about a $3,000 value versus the water heater that you typically get on other campers. So this is a dual axle, of course, and it does have Goodyear tires, which are some of the best tires on the market. And we also have tire pressure monitors. So as long as you're green on the stem cap, you're good to go. Another great thing about this RV is that it does have the tempered glass door. It looks really great. And it does have a back here for security. And it's also prepped for a thin shade as well if you'd like to add one for additional security. And this is a friction hinge door so it'll hold itself open on those light wind days versus other campers where it has those plastic pieces that always break. So here we have the more right step above step. These are the kind of steps that you typically find on a fifth wheel, but with Cherokee, we do include these. The feet are adjustable to different heights and it's super easy to get in and out for people of all ages. And it also has an extra large door handle as well. Another great thing about this RV is that it does have electric stabilizer jacks. So you just press and hold and they will go up and down. That way you don't have to hand crank with these as well. And we also have a second leash latch too if you need one down here or you have the option of using either or. It's got a large electric awning with blue LED lights too that matches the lights on the inside and also the uh, marine grade speakers there. It does have vents as well. So to let out fuel fumes, you can just open these up and it'll go ahead and vent out the toy hauler area. So here we have the ramp door. This is in the patio setting right now. These pieces are super easy to move in and out. One of the best systems that I've seen. And it also has screens as well to keep bugs out. Another great thing about this camper, I didn't set it up because it's muddy right here, but there are steps that you can attach right here and you can walk straight up and down the ramp door instead of going around. And then when you wanna lo load a golf cart up, all you have to do is remove this pin and the one on the other side and the ramp door drops down. So there you can see the prep for the backup camera there and also a scare light so you can eliminate your camping area wherever you are. It's also ready for a ladder as well. We do have those available in parts, but that's a cool new setup that Forest River has come out with. Here we have a second spray port back here, city water connection for continuous water, fresh water for going off grid. There's a 12 volt pump inside that will circulate water when you don't have pressurized water. Here we have the outlet for the sewer tank, which is on the right, the black tank. This is gonna be the kitchen tank on the left. And then we have 50 amp power. This does have two ACs, which we need down here in Texas. So it's stay nice and cool, but this is how it hooks up to power. If you have cable or satellite at a campsite, this is where it plugs in. And then we also have a hot and cold outside shower here as well. 
So we have a total of three outdoor showers. We also have a black tank flush as well. So that will clean out your toilet tank and it reduces smell and gives you more accurate tank readings. This RV has one slide. So this is a rack and pinion slide, one of the most dependable slide systems out there. And it gives super high headroom as well, which is really great. This is gonna be the other outlet there. And then the other side of the pass-through storage. And this is also a wide body, it's 102 inches. So although it's not a super long camper, it feels plenty large with that large slide and also the additional width. So here we are on the inside. As soon as you come in, you have this pantry right here, plenty of storage. And another neat thing is that you actually have a camera prep on the inside so you can keep an eye on your toys while you're hauling them. This is gonna be our control panel. So what's great about Cherokee is that it's a smart panel. You can download an app and control the majority of your RV straight from your phone. Additional light switches here. And then we also have built-in solar so that shows you where your battery's at. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring the slide in so you can see how much room you have. It's just this button right there, press and hold and it comes on in. And there you go, the slide basically goes right up to that little cabinet area there. But you have plenty of access here. You can even open the door and get to the bathroom. Here we have the toy hauler section, and these are the Happy Jack beds. You got one for Cameron, one for Case, and plenty of tie downs here as well. I'm gonna go ahead and pop it back open. Uh, by the way, you can still get to the fridge, uh, the sink, all the counters here, which is really great. So now we'll press and hold out. It'll go ahead and go out. There we go. And another great thing about this panel is that it is backlit, so you can see exactly where your tanks are. With older panels, you have to press and hold buttons to see, but as you're going in and out, you can see exactly where it is. Also see where your battery is as well, so that's really nice. So this is the rack and pinion slide I was telling you about. Um, you know, I'm right about six feet tall, so still have plenty of room. You don't have to slouch and worry about hitting your head as you go in and out, as with other slides. So it's super tall, super wide, and is super dependable as well. These recliners are heat and massage when hooked up to main power. Very, very comfortable. You got the cup holders here, storage there, and it's right across from the TV prep, the entertainment center here, so you have a perfect viewing angle from the recliners. We have great overhead storage here as well. This fireplace does actually work, but your main heat source is a propane furnace that's on the floor, but you can just have a light show or have secondary heat there. Here we have the fridge. This is a 10 cubic foot all electric fridge. Cools down much faster than the old style propane electric ones and offers you anywhere between uh, two to four additional cubic feet of space. Here we have the residential power microwave. It'll very quickly and evenly heat food. A range hood that actually works as we'll vent outside. While you're working on this three burner cooktop, you have the glass insert there for additional counter space. Rear tier burners are for simmering. Front one is for boiling. And then you also have a uh, little night light there. And the great thing about the stove and oven is that the igniter is built in. You don't need a lighter. Here we have the oven. That's gonna be the switch for the battery disconnect. So whenever you're storing your camper, you wanna turn that off and the battery won't deplete as fast. Converter is there. Great counter space. We have a one piece undermount stainless steel sink, much more sanitary than plastic and easier to keep clean. High rise faucet here too. Great storage up top. There you go drawers down here and now this RV does have two ACs which what's really really great is that these are Coleman ACs they're very quiet very dependable and this is a racetrack system so they both work together to cool the whole unit usually your secondary unit only cools one area but these both work together and let's say that you're sitting here on a hot day like today you can go ahead and have this open and it quick cools this area or if you have it closed it'll go ahead and circulate throughout the vents. You do have a thermostat for each one as well. And if you go somewhere that only has 30 amp power, you can use a converter and still run one AC as well. And this is gonna be the radio. It works only on Bluetooth, but that's pretty cool. Here we have the private master bedroom. This is a king bed. You have a ward on each side for hanging clothes. Nice stand for food and drink here, and also power on both sides. 
two AC vents and prep for a TV. What's really nice is that that's a 12 volt plug. So if you want to operate your TV on battery, you can plug it in there or you have regular power and coaxial there. Light switch here, power down there, heat here. And then we also have the storage underneath the bed there, as you can see. Another great thing about this RV is that it does have zebra blinds. So you can either black it out or let some light in. These are really cool. And then you do have windows in the slides as well. Some manufacturers don't do that to save on cost, but with Cherokee, they want to give you the absolute best value. So we do have windows all throughout the slide. This dinette also converts into a bed too. If Case and Cameron want to bring some friends along, you can sleep two here. And then you also have 40 inch doors that go all the way back as well for storage. Now, let me go ahead and show you the Happy Jack beds. So this is super simple. You just press and hold the button. The bottom bunk comes up. And you also have a privacy curtain there, as you can see. And that's it. Now you're ready to drive a toy in. These are the steps I was telling you about that attach the ramp door outside. You have power here, power there. And these are really cool to black it out. That just pops right off, which is really great. Super easy. Here we have the ramp door area, little entertainment area. You can mount a TV here. And then these are actually uh, aluminum and you have some storage under there. Here we have the prep for the backup camera, that scare light. Now let's move on to the bathroom. Really great size bathroom. And of course with the toy hauler, you have higher ceilings, so no issue with ceiling height in here. We also have a shroud, so this protects your wall from moisture. A lot of campers only have the paneling, but this will protect it from humidity. Skylight for additional headroom and natural light. We do have a fan here. Uh, to vent out fumes and then you also have um, the AC vent there as well. This window does open and another great feature about this camper is that we have a tankless water heater so you just turn it on set it to whatever temperature you want and it'll maintain that temperature working with propane. We do have medicine cabinet here, dedicated sink here and power as well. Okay, Lindsay, I wanted to show you this 27 pack 10. I'd love to serve you and your family at the highest level on your camper. If you and Brian have any questions at all, feel free to reach out 979-413-9554. And I hope you have an awesome weekend. Thanks again.